I'm done with this shit, dude. Zeppelin pulled this shit. I fucking see Zeems doing this shit. Be a fucking leader, bro. Be whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm going to stop you I'm right there, okay? No, 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 no. Don't pull that be a leader bullshit with me. Just because I'm a streamer, just because I have an audience. No, yeah. no, 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 no. Don't pull that bullshit. Nah, see, that's where the ego's coming in. That's where the ego's coming in. Be a leader. No, no, no. This guy thinks he's a leader. <laughs> No, 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 no. I don't want to lead anybody, okay? D dude, I, I fucking jack off to anime. The only thing I'm leading is my hand to my fucking cock, okay? That's the only thing I'm good at leading, I he was okay? I slow. Like, dude, first off, like, just because you're a streamer does not mean that you're a, in, in a leadership position, dude. I don't want to lead anybody, okay? I'm not going to tell anybody what to do. Like, I want people to think for themselves. I don't want a bunch of sheep around me. You know what I'm saying? Like, being nice and courteous to each other, that's fine. But, like, just yes men, I hate yes men. I used to be a fucking yes man, dude. I used to be one. Back when I worked at fucking FedEx and shit, man. It was the most miserable experience in my fucking life. Okay? I can like, see that. you need to think for yourselves. Like, I'm not trying to lead anybody, okay? So don't, no, 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 no. Don't pull that be a leader, bro, bullshit on me, okay? That, see, that's where, I, that's where I think the ego, the ego is coming in. Because this, 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 because that's this guy's mentality. Is he's a streamer, so he's a leader, okay? That's why, yeah, that's, that's that ego. He's a fucking leader. Mm. That doesn't mean Ben to the... Mm. No, 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 I disagree with that. So what the, what the, how, where the, what the, how the, what the fuck? This doesn't make any sense. You're clearly, it's clearly aimed at them. Do you, do you pretty, pretty anecdotal and not circum, uh, it's not, not substantiated in any way. You're saying, I haven't seen it. I don't really myself with people that do that shit. You got pulled on the VOD. Okay. But it was at that part. Cause that's what I saw with that type of, uh, stuff being said to him um specifically on crystal and then you have these the multitudes of forum posters that are just being told that their issue isn't real and that they should just get over it i just don't think that's right is this wait is this about a chair what the fuck right and so I made the analogy that it's an, and it's an extreme hyperbolic analogy. So please don't take this out of context, you fucking dumbasses. But I made the analogy of being accused of, of murder when you didn't do it. Someone calling you a pedophile is serious and not okay. That's not cool. Okay. I want to ask if the Lala player is being called and labeled as... Uh, P word doesn't doesn't that count as harassment and reportable to GMs? I'm sure it does. I'm sure I'm sure they probably report it. Oh my fucking god! Let him cook. No, we're gonna take this off the we're gonna take this off the stove. Let me let me just go ahead. Let me just hit y'all up with the right take, okay? Is that obviously people that don't that play Lalafells? Obviously, they're not categorically pedos. Of fucking course not. No shit. There's plenty of people who play them, and they just think they're funny or stupid or cute. That's like 99%. Kind of a stretch. Yeah, that's, that's nutty. Nobody thinks that. Lollafells look like children. Zeno said that and Pyro started raging. I mean, aren't Lollafells based on chibis and chibis sound a whole lot like children? I think Lollafells are, I mean, like in every sense, they're based on kids. Like, fucking duh. Obviously, they're based on kids. But just because you play a kid character doesn't mean that you want to have sex with it. That's totally fucking different. Does that mean every single person that plays an undead is a necrophiliac? No. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Nobody thinks this.
Holy shit! Defamation serious. It can ruin people's lives. And that's part of why this fucking 30 second clip shit is bullshit. That's why I fucking hate that shit. You know I... People do 30 second clips because they're more interesting and they get people more mad. You can get somebody way more mad with a 30 second clip than you can with an actually fully context out uh, conversation. And people like being mad. They don't want to hear. They don't have a conversation about this. Knew someone would clip that fucking analogy. Uh -huh. I literally even said it after I made the analogy. I think I even said it before I made the analogy. That someone's going to take it out of context. Someone's going to clip it just like they did. I think he was rewatching your VOD. Oh, he got pulled on the VOD. Okay. But it was at that part. Because that's what I saw. Okay. Let's move over. It's just bullshit, dude. How come I'm the only... Dude, how come it feels like I'm the only motherfucker that ever gets held accountable for the shit he says, dude? What the... I do think that's kind of true, that whenever Pyro has a meltdown, people react like... It's like a Pyro meltdown can take a school project volcano and turn it into fucking Mount Vesuvius or some other... I, I, is that a volcano? I, I don't know if it is or not. But like, uh, 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 like Yellowstone erupting. Like, I have no idea. But people make a fucking mountain out of a molehill whenever Pyro gets mad about shit. This is totally true. I hear about this all the time. Anytime this guy gets mad, I hear about it. Vesuvius killed Com Pompeii? I mean, that that's a pretty bad volcano. Fuck. Why? Is it easy to pick on me? Is it because I get mad? Yes. Why am I the only What do you mean? Obviously, it's because you get mad. Like, yes, 100% it's because you get mad. What, what other reason could it possibly be? <laughs> yes. Motherfucker, whoever has to take responsibility. Or just admit maybe it was a bad take. And that doesn't ruin your persona and make you look like a bitch. <laughs> Since you're so clearly worried about that. Empathy is not weakness. Apathy is weakness. Okay, actually, you know what? I, I know what I can do. I can look on the clip and I can see the time on his VOD. And then it should probably tell me the time that he was watching Pyro's VOD. Logically, that's what would make sense. So it'd be 3.51 p.m. Oh, 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 it's about to happen. Okay, okay, all right, all right, it's about to happen. <sighs> and again, I want to also say one last time. Here we go. And fucking clip this. Here we go. Clip this is my Here last we go. Here end we go. take. Here we go. Do just the same as the Zeppelin situation. Do I think that Zeem's stance on this makes him a bad person? No. No. Do I want to cancel Zeem's? No. That's fucking dumb. No. But do I... Will I speak up when I take issue with something I saw in a video? Yeah, probably going to do so. And that's not unique to, to him. That is not unique to him. Okay, okay, all right. Yeah, Spooky, and that's what I want people to understand is it's not about the chair, dude. I don't care about the fucking chair. And if you watch my VOD, there's an, I don't compl I'm not really complaining about the chair. Before I even get into it, I say, ah, it's a little childish looking, and I kind of wish it wasn't white and pink. If they would have just done a neutral color, there wouldn't even be an issue, dude. It was just, why, like, why does it have to be childlike and white and, like, come on, dude. The reason is because Lalafels are kids. They act like kids a lot of times. They have, like, they emote like kids. They look like kids. That's the reason. It, it, it's not really a secret. It, it's the, even the lore. Yes.
They're designed as kids. I, I, I mean, th th there it is. You know, Zeems made a, someone made a joke to Zeems in the video. They said, what if they gave Rogadin a special furniture and it was a really tiny, small stool? Wouldn't that be funny? And Zeems like, yeah, that would be hilarious. Yeah, be Except funny. that's not what they did. Another false equivalence. That's not what they did. The opposite of that would be giving Lalafels a huge chair. Did, why didn't I thought they did that though? Because aren't the Lalafels not able to sit in the chair? Because it's wait no I thought that's what it was. That's uh, the that's the comparison. You don't just get hold. Oh, they gave him a a a, a high chair esque fucking chair. Uh, you know, like. <sighs> This is crazy, bro. Like, read the chat, bro. People are just going in and in and in about this. Holy shit. Bro, they need to bring out a new raid or something. Like, they gotta, they gotta put something else in that game, man. Like, holy fuck. Like, this is the same shit that would happen in WoW. Like, whenever there wouldn't be any content out for a while. Like, people get into this shit. Cause it's like there's not like you know back in COVID whenever people started creating like all these problems that didn't exist. Like, there's like one thing to get mad about, and like so everybody has to get mad about that one thing, you know? Like, that's just what ha it happened in WoW too, all the time. This is the new raid. I think sometimes people say something wrong and then under normal circumstances might look back and say, oh my bad, but I, I think a lot of people, especially streamers, can sometimes get love bombed by actual awful people who once said streamer to double down either because they want them to be as awful as them or because they want to create a simu situation that's bad for everyone. Regardless of their intent, like, they, like, you've heard me talk about things that have happened recently. Like, I literally had one of my mods leave my Discord because of my take about the Hithlodeus and the trans thing on Twitter. I basically made a tone deaf comment saying, how could I be, you know, transphobic if this and that? And it was just dumb and tone deaf. You know what I mean? And so I had a mod flat out leave. I had another mod say to me, bro, like we, you know, let's, we all got in a voice and we all talked about it and talked about how I handled the situation and they gave me their takes and how you know, they didn't agree with what I was fucking doing. One of my mods, Akira, that fucking guy almost never agrees with me. Ever. That fucking guy's always telling me what I can do to be better. You gotta stop talking to him like that. This is an endless and bottomless abyss. There will never be a point where you are better enough or good enough. You have bettered yourself a thousand times and you are still found wanting. Why is this even happening? That guy never dick rides. Uh -huh. I don't fucking surround myself with people that do that shit. I surround myself with people that are like-minded, but also independent enough to fucking call me out if I'm a dumbass. Somebody in chat goes and they say this, right? They say, regardless of whether or not you think they look or act like children, people need to go the fuck outside so they stop actually considering the sexuality of a fucking MMO character. Bro, like, it's not really considering. There's a lot, like, I mean, like, let's just, let's just lay it, let's just lay it, let's lay it out flat, okay? There's a lot of RP that happens in Final Fantasy. There's a lot of erotic ERP that happens at Final Fantasy. And if you're going around ERPing as a Lalafell, that makes other people uncomfortable because of the implications behind the character's visual appearance. That's, that's what it is. And there are people on Twitter, whenever I had an interview with one of the uh, sex modders in Final Fantasy XIV, 
uh, that were these not safe for work Lollafell accounts that went on private or they disabled their account. Uh, hopefully it stayed that way. But I do think that the kind of people that do that kind of stuff might, you know, the FBI might want to look at what's on their computer. If you're making not safe for work Lollafell content. Yes. I mean, come on. It's not crazy. Oh, shit, I messed up. And if you can't see that, that is what frustrates me. That is the problem. Is that it isn't about the chair. Yeah, you're right. The chair thing is fucking stupid. It's the deeper meaning of what the chair implies. And if you can't think deeply, then that's a problem. What's, your, what's the TLDR of your take? I think that, that what he said in his video was very dismissive. I think that it was clearly, he says that he doesn't care, but he clearly was taking the side of the aggressors of the people who were making fun of the other people. He commented on one other, one other person's comments saying they should get subbed and modded and all this stuff for a very rude and dismissive thing that they said. He's literally actively supporting the side of negativity, but claiming that he's not on a side and that he doesn't care. But he doesn't realize that his actions speak louder than his words. Even though he's got a loud voice. That's my TLDR. I had to, I was watching his, his videos. They were hilarious. We got to the one about Lala's. I thought it would be a measured middling take, something more along the lines with Asmongold, someone who sees the side of the people who don't want to be called pedos because they play a fucking Lala fell and sees the side of people who think it's hilarious that people would get upset over a chair. I get that. I get that, it, oh, you know, at, at face value, this chair thing is really stupid. It is. But. I want you to understand that there's people that are upset not about the face value of the chair. That's why this is such a dumb fucking argument. I shouldn't have to explain these things. The, re the, the reason insin the words insinuation, inference, uh, suggest, imply, those, all, those words all exist for a reason. Just sounds like a really bad misunderstanding. <laughs> I don't think I misunderstood it. No, I don't think so. I don't think I misunderstood what he said in the video. Chat, was I... Look, sometimes I don't understand things how people... Uh, uh, hold on, I got a mod message. I'm a mod in Zeem's channel. I permit a few more who went into the chat to talk shit. That's the least I could do to help the shitstorm civil since Zeno acts... I appreciate that, Iowa. Thank you for doing that. And, and, I, and if you get anyone coming over doing that shit, I don't, I, don't appro I don't approve of that either. This isn't a fucking war. I just really did not fucking like the take in the video. And I have powerful opinions about, especially with the things that are happening in our country right now, I just have powerful opinions about people who have, who have sweeping statements made about them and in, inferences made about them. And it just makes me mad that uh, someone who's very high up in the community, who has a lot of... I mean, Zeno doesn't think everybody that plays a Lollafell is a, like some kind of like weirdo, right? Like, did he say that? There's no way he said that. viewers has a take like that it's very frustrating because it just seems fucking irresponsible now is it my job to determine what his responsibilities are no but at the end of the day i'm entitled to that fucking opinion and i think it was a huge l take and many people in my chat also agreed so this isn't some cognitive dissonance that exists just in my mind but with that all being said i don't want anyone coming over there saying shit either <clears throat> His take was that Lollafells look like children, so he didn't care uh, items that support that were added. Pyro's upset that Zeno was dismissive of Lollafell players that are annoyed of the infantil infantilization of Lollafells, though now the devs as well. It's silly. Guys, they look like kids. They emote like kids. 
It's reinforced by the lore. If you don't want people to treat you like you're a little kid, then don't play a character that looks like a little kid. Because that's what it is. I, I don't understand how this is even a conversation. What is this? Title says, receive some new items. I saw this. How much Lollafell players hate the infantilization we keep getting barraged with just because we want to play the short race and then they go and they add this. This is about the chair. Of course they're infantilized. Because they look like four-year-olds. How is this even a conversation? No fucking shit. They're getting treated like kids. Because they look like little fucking kids. Look like kids, act like kids, talk like kids. There's a literal cat tree addressed to the uh, Makoti. It's the cat girls is a cat tree for the cat girls. Yeah. Some people always play the short race. So what? I mean, if you play a Torin and wow, and you get on a Kodo and you try to ride into the auction house and you can't fit because the character model's too big. You're not making a thread on the Blizzard forums getting pissed off that Blizzard did this to you. Because that's what you get whenever you play a goddamn fucking seven foot cow. That's just how it is. I mean, damn. Who's getting mad? Lava fell and not children and it is disgusting people. They are kids, bro. What are you talking about? What do you mean? Oh my god. These people are so delusional. They're... Oh my god. This is such an easy take, but Hobbits and Lord of the Rings? Maybe? No, Hobbits... ...are completely fucking different. It is not the size of the character that makes them kids. It is their physiology. They are physiologically four or five years old. Hobbits are just small people. How is... How, how am I... I feel like I'm taking crazy pills. I, it, it, am I... What is this? By that logic, midgets would be kids? No, they wouldn't be. No. No. Ugh. Oh my god. People, I'm losing my fucking mind. Lollafell don't procreate for a reason. Do Lollafells not procreate? Oh my god. By the other commenter's logic. Oh, oh yeah, for sure. You're correct. Wow and Hobbits are stunted adults. Lollafell are something completely different. Isn't that the whole point? That they uh, that they are kids? Th not that they're kids, but it relates to pedo? No. 
You're not a creep just you, because you play a character that looks like a kid. That's fucking insane. Is somebody a creep because they play Ness in fucking, uh, in Smash Brothers? No. Is somebody a cow because they play a Tauren? No. Is somebody a furry because they play a Worgen? No, but there's a lot that are. But listen, no, that doesn't make you the character. People play undead and they're not necrophiliacs. People play Torin, and they're not into bestiality. How the fuck are people so, so fucking stupid? You lack context for how he usually handles things. He lacked context on how the shit from chat going on, so you just pretty much talk past each other. It just sucks. I agree. It does fucking suck. It also fucking sucks, dude. When someone fucking tries to put you on blast in front of 2,000 people with the, with the fucking analogy thing. That just pisses me off, dude. It's such a bad faith. It's, it's not bad faith. It's, it's pedantic is what it is. You choose to single out one statement that I made instead of listening to the 20 minutes of things that I had to say. It's pedantic as fuck. And it's underhanded. I, I'm not even making any comments on what Pyro's saying, right? Like, I, I don't know. I, I, it's, it's so weird because, like, there's so many, like, you know, general, like, nouns used. Like, what it was and what was said. Like, what, what was this? I, I'm not even really sure. I... He said Final Fantasy XIV racism is equal to IRL racism. Oh my god. <sighs> It, it, it doesn't have to be Lollafell. If you play any type of character that, that people will um, <clears throat> people will just message you and be like, wow, you're a fucking pedo and shit like that. Like, that's, like, that, like that is fucked up. But at the same... Okay, so he agrees. Uh, well, like, at the same time, man, like... <sighs> it just... Like, don't get me wrong. Like, I feel sorry for those people. You shouldn't have to experience that. But it's the internet, man. Like, it's the internet. Like, you... There's just so it's, many people are yeah. so thin-skinned nowadays, man. Like, you just... Yeah, it's... I know you don't want to hear that. But you know how easy it is to just block someone? Yeah, that's another thing, too. Like, male or raw is like an in-real-life groomer and shit, you know? Like, I mean, it, it's just... Dude, you just block them, man. Just block them and move on, man. Yeah. yeah. You know? I don't understand what the problem is. Like, if someone messages me something stupid in game, just block them. Yeah. Uh, I just block Report them. Like, how hard is that? I don't understand. Like, so that's why the comparison to the game, to RL, is so absurd to me. Because you can't fucking do that in RL, you know? I mean, people fucking get stalked all the time. People fucking attack you. They have weapon. Like, dude, it, it, it's it's not the same at all. You're this is this this comparison you're making literally comes from you being an ignorant fuck. That he's right about this. Uh, that you can't really block people and turn shit off in real life about you. Like, for example, like you can just re-roll your character if it bothers you so much. You can't re-roll your race. Like, I, there have been people that try, but everybody knows. Has no idea what they're talking about. And, like, I don't know if it's ego. This guy seems to be a very egotistical person. Um, I do know people that have helped him in game. And, uh, again, I don't know. So, maybe I'm wrong. But his ego is out of this fucking world. And, um... Uh... <laughs> I don't think he's the type of person that I would help. No, absolutely not. Be able to hang out in channels that allow you to do that. Guess what? Mine's not one of them, bitch. So see you later. Ah, sorry, sorry. Hold on. I didn't get the. Just I be didn't... able to dis why it's fucked up. Chair, by the way, Keck W. 
Yeah, it's so funny, bro. It's so funny to just be able to disregard entire groups of people's feelings because you think it's a meme. It's pretty good, isn't it? Isn't it nice to be such a fucking- Well, yeah, because sometimes people's feelings are stupid. People sometimes have stupid feelings that nobody needs to listen to or give a fuck about. Sometimes people just have dumb fucking opinions and you just put them in the garbage. And it's fun to laugh at people who have these dumb fucking opinions and want to die on a hill of some shit that doesn't make any sense. Yeah. That's right. Like, like I've felt that way. A lot of people have. Yo, stop spamming, FaZe. Shut the fuck up, pussy. Get the fuck out of here. Stop it. I saw it the first time. Sorry? Yeah, me too. Dumb fuck on the internet that that's how you get to live? Yeah, it must be nice to be able to hang out in channels that allow you to do that. Guess what? Mine's not one of them, bitch. So see you later. I'm done with this shit, dude. Zeppelin pulled this shit. I fucking see Zeems doing this shit. Be a fucking leader, bro. And this is the part Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm a dude. This. That's fine. It's a miserable experience in my fucking life. Me, okay? That, see, that's where, I, that's where I think the ego... The ego is coming in because this, 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 because that's this guy's mentality is he's a streamer. So he's a leader. Okay. That's why. It that's a good point. I do think that, uh, you know, the people will always put a responsibility on some other content creator to talk about an issue or to have a certain opinion on things. Yeah. This is very common. It's annoying. Yeah. That's, that's that ego. A fucking leader. Hmm. That doesn't mean Ben to Mm. No, 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 I disagree with that. Disagree with that, hundred percent. All right. Uh, let's take a look at it. Holy shit! It's an hour video. Uh, let's see. And it just—he's <laughs> literally actively supporting the side of negativity but claiming that he's not on a side and that he doesn't care. What? right the chair thing is fucking stupid okay. it's the deeper meaning of what the chair implies and if you can't think deeply then that's a problem what's your what's the tldr of your take i think that that what he said in his video was very dismissive I think that it was clearly, he says that he doesn't care, but he clearly was taking the side of the aggressors, of the people who were. Yeah, I don't think he watched my video. Uh, I, I never once took the side of people that were bullying others. Uh -uh. No, I just said that the people that were being bullied needed to get fucking thicker skin and realize that this is a video game and it's very easy to block and move on. Stop being a pussy. Exactly. Yes, yeah, just stop it. Just stop being a pussy. Holy shit. Like, it, it's not hard. And if it if it bothers you that much, just report them to the to the developer and they'll get banned. That's the advantage of the internet is that you can block people and move on. Um, yes. I do think it's unfortunate that people do experience that. But again, it's the internet. That's real life. It's You're going happen. to have problems in real life. Yeah. And this is not a big problem. No, I'm sorry. It's not. I'm sorry if you're <laughs> affected by it, but it's not a big problem. Not when you can just ban somebody or block somebody and fucking move on, man. I do it all the time. All the time. Oh I do it God. literally every day. Okay. <laughs> it's easy. All right. Look, I'm going to ban this fucking guy right now because he's spamming in my chat. See ya, idiot! Get the fuck out of here! You see how easy that was? Rippeth bozoeth. Make sure you drink with your pinky up. Oh my Ooh, fucking god. that tastes so god. much sweeter after a ban. You know, it's so easy to do it, that. It does, okay? actually. We're making fun of the other people. He commented on one other, one other person's comments saying they should get subbed and modded and all this stuff for a very rude and dismissive thing <laughs> that they said. <laughs> Okay, okay, all right, look, 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 okay, again, okay, oh look, look, man, look, again, again. The onion, okay, the onion. There are layers of memes, okay, so for those of you that are not aware, 
I was not serious. <laughs> I was not serious when I wanted to mod VIP in or, and uh, gift the, the whoever a sub, okay? It's, 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 it's a meme, all right? That's like whenever I pretended to be Mav, whenever I found out it was International Women's Day. Like, people, people, there was like three or four people that tweeted at me about that. They were like, bro, like, how can you just go mask off like that and say that your, your day is ruined because it's International Women's Day? Do you, you actually just hate women? What the fuck is wrong with you? And the, again, this is another thing that he's taken serious that's supposed to be funny. Uh... And I, you know, he might not watch the stream, uh, so he probably wouldn't know. Okay, but this is supposed to be a joke. Okay, all right, this is <laughs> this is supposed to be a joke. All right, he's literally fun of the other people. Okay, he commented on one other one other person's comments saying they should get subbed and modded and all this stuff for a very rude and dismissive thing that they said. He's literally actively supporting. <laughs> Okay. All right. Yo, in his defense, dude, in his defense, it could be taken that way. Okay. Like, I'm not even mad that he said this. Okay. Because in his defense, when you, <laughs> like when you, when you have a, a person that like spams a Hydra in the chat. Okay. And then Twitch chat is like, you know, hands up. Oh, mighty Hydra. Like gift that man a sub vip his ass you know like it, it's an inside give us kisses okay it's an inside joke okay it's like oh a meme on God. the stream you know and uh you know it's a meme so so uh, it it's just one of those things where unless you watch the stream you're not gonna actually know and it, it, it is possible that you would take you would take it serious okay guys stop oh, people, stop okay oh all people right people do this with me all the time like uh, the other day, I said that I wanted to use AI art to uh, fucking uh, to make an art style that looks like a popular artist on Twitter and then commission, pretend like I commissioned art from them and tell them thank you for the art, even though I never did, right? It's a joke. And this fucking idiot on Twitter made a whole thread about this and they were like tagging me in this and getting mad about it and it's like you actually think i would do this do you think i would go out of my way to do this it's too much work i don't know how to do that it's too much work i can't i don't know how to do it it stop i knew i shouldn't have said it please stop stop okay no more that's like five dicks. We can move on. Okay. The Does side of negativity, yeah. but claiming that he's not on a side and that he doesn't care, but he doesn't realize hmm. that his actions speak. Unfortunately, I, I, I really feel like that his initial reaction was to get mad and that everything else or everything that happened after the initial reaction was just mad because I'm already mad. Like there's no, like he didn't like, basically he stopped thinking. He turned his brain off. Oh, I do that every you time know? I play. Like when brain. he got in, I feel like that that's just who he is. I feel like that when he gets mad or upset, it just spirals out of fucking control. Yeah. And it just snowballs into, you know, shit. Right. Yeah, and I feel like that. that, that, you know, the smallest thing could set him off. Maybe he has thin skin. I've heard of his chat triggering him before uh, by the smallest thing. Okay. So that might just. <laughs> he says that. And he's trying not to smile. <gasps> what? The smallest thing could set him off. Maybe he has thin skin. I've heard of his chat triggering him before uh, by the smallest thing. <laughs> Okay, so that might just oh be God. who he is. That might be his personality. But so far, those two things, the man mode thing and then this thing where he thinks I'm siding with the aggressor, yeah. those are literally just memes. They're just jokes. And he didn't get those jokes. He didn't understand those jokes. Um, 
And I, I feel like that if he would have thought for a second, he probably would have been like, oh, okay, I get it. Or he might not have. I have no idea. Loud. But dude, the fact that he took that serious is so fucking funny. Dude. <laughs> Gift that man a sub, mod him, VIP him, and then ban him. Fuck him. Louder than his words. Even though he's got a loud voice. Yeah, sometimes I sometimes I yell. That's my TLDR. I had to. I was watching his his videos. They were hilarious. We got to the one about Lala's. I thought it would be a measured, middling take, mm. something more along the lines with Asmongold, someone who sees the side of the people. Asmin out of. Asmin out. Oh do, wait, double video. Wait. Oh my God, is this gonna be? Is this gonna be? Oh no. Does Asmin have a? He did not. I talked about it, but I didn't make a video of it. What is he talking about? Huh. People who don't want to be called pedos. Is that video okay? Okay. It's because they play a fuck ass. We got to the one about Lala's. I thought it would be a measured, middling take, something more along the lines with Asmongold. Someone who sees the side of the people who don't want to be called What is he talking about then? Asmongold's take. I have no idea. Okay. Pedos because they play a fucking Lollafell and sees the side of people who think it's hilarious that people would get upset over a chair. I get that. I get that. It, oh, you know, at, at face value, this chair thing is really stupid. Does Pyro know that me and him agree on everything? Like, we both think that the chair is stupid. We both think that it's fucked up that people get bullied for being called pedo. Yeah, duh. What the fuck set him off? <laughs> he should have really watched the whole video. <laughs> he should have watched the whole video. But I want you to understand that there's people that are upset not about the face value of the chair. That's why this is such a dumb fucking argument. I shouldn't have to explain these things. The, re the, the reason, insin the words insinuation, inference, uh, suggest, imply, those, all, those words. No, I said that. No, I, no, okay, okay. No, I said, okay. No, I said that to him. I, I, okay, okay, here, okay, here, okay, here's the thing. When I heard he was like, you know, calling me idiot and all this shit, you know, okay, so, okay, so we're name calling. Okay, okay, I can be petty too, you know, I can be petty too. Uh, so I said that I'd talk to him only if he cleared DSR because I know that that hurt his ego. I know that he sucks at the game and I know that that would really piss him off. So that's why I said it. That's why I said it. <laughs> I don't actually, I didn't actually mean for him to clear. <laughs> okay, guys, look, okay. <laughs> I know how to piss people off. I'm a streamer, okay? You know those, like, jabs at the ego? Those are the worst jabs, okay? And I know he's an oh egotistical God. person, and I know that he hasn't done that. I, I mean, he's not... I mean, he sucks at the game, right? So oh I know God. that that would affect him, okay? So that's why I said it. I don't actually... Dude, I don't actually expect him to do it, okay? Oh if he does it, if he does it, I will be the first person to say congratulations, man. Yeah, you know, good. you should be proud of your accomplishment, yeah. and I'm glad that you fucking cleared this shit. You know, I hope you had fun. You know, I'll be the first motherfucker to say that. Okay? Wait, why say it like that? He sucks at the game? I mean, is it... Look, man, I cut through the bullshit. I'm not trying to pussyfoot around. I don't have time to say things nice. Okay? What I said is true. It is. Is it not? Okay, can we move on now? Okay, thank you. So anyway, I'm all right. I didn't actually mean for him to 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 take that serious. Again, I said it at a jab at his ego. You know, I needed to. You know, I wanted to humble him. He needs. To I think as soon as you start talking mad shit on like a personal level, that I think yeah, absolutely, there's nothing wrong with that. Know his place in the 14 community, and he's know his place in the streaming community, you know, and he's got an ego. And I, 
I said it at a jab at his ego. You know, I needed to, you know, I wanted to humble him. He needs to know his place in the 14 community. He needs to know his Jeez. place in the streaming community, Jesus. you know, and he's got an ego. And I can, I can smell ego from a mile away, oh dude. I God. used to have an ego. Um, I know what ego looks like. I know the mentality of it, and I fucking hate it, okay? Oh, my God. So I don't tolerate that. Okay, I, I don't put up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Used to look, man. Okay, I'm confident. There's there. There is a difference. Okay, I'm confident. Okay, you guys can fucking joke all you want, but you will never hear me try to be cocky about healing or DPS. Okay, that's why I stick to casual healing and casual DPS. And that's why I call myself shit all the time because I know my place. All right. I am a one trick tank main and I barely can play that. Okay. I'm confident in my tanking abilities. Okay. But my point here is that when I said that, it was basically like, oh, okay, you want to call me an idiot? Okay. Well, then I'll say something well, to you. You're an idiot. And, you know, we can, yeah. we can exchange a few words, you know, just poking fun at each other yep. just you know it's whatever you know um but i didn't expect him I'm to take it serious too. okay <laughs> i just knew that it would make him mad <laughs> all right words all exist for a reason am i confident in my reading abilities you know what i'm you know what i read your chat get the fuck out of here get the fuck out of here i read that see ya <laughs> Just sounds like a really bad misunderstanding. <laughs> I don't think I misunderstood it. No, I don't think so. I, I, I disagree. I don't think you watched the whole video. If you were to watch the whole video, I think you oh maybe wanted to get mad and you just picked a spot to get mad at. That's what I think. I don't think I misunderstood what he said in the video. Chat, was I... Look, sometimes I don't understand things how people... Uh, uh, hold on, I got a mod message. I'm a mod in Zeme's channel. I permit a few more who into this chat to talk shit. That's the least I could do to help the shitstorm civil since Zeno acts. I appreciate that, Iowa. Thank you for doing that. We saw this in work. the video about them. He he doesn't. He thinks it's a problem that people that play like you know Lollafell and stuff they get they get bullied. Okay, it okay. Now I obviously have never experienced that, but if that is happening, I think it's a problem too. I I think it's fucked up that if you get a you get a message, but at the same time. It's on the same level as just normal harassment. It's not a big deal. Because it's on the internet and it's a video game. It's just it's just really not a big deal. Like to me, this is just uh, harassment, right? Like I don't think that this is like like this is not racism in a video game. Like this is just straight harassment. So I don't, that's the part where his, his connection is completely wrong. Okay. Like what, what, if you get a message playing a Lollafell, like lol fucking pedo, like that's just literally harassment, man. That's just, just, just harassment. Just fucking ban him and block him, dude. Yeah. I get that shit all the time. Like I would say, I would even go farther than that. If somebody types you that shit, I would report them. Like fuck them, man. Somebody starts to get gets gets on that energy. They get on that level. Fucking report them. Like who wants to deal with that shit? Ugh. Time, okay. You know, I get that shit all. I mean, maybe not in game, but in YouTube comments and stuff. And yeah. you know, people like it. Just it is what it is. Um, so it. But as far as him having an issue, like him thinking that it's fucked up that people to play Lala Fell are getting harassed. I share that same mentality, but it's not just on Lala Fells. It's on anybody that just randomly gets a message. Like, I think that's fucked up. Like, why would you just randomly sit like randomly? Yeah. Um, message something like that. That's so fucking, that's so dumb. You know what I mean? It is dumb. Like, so I agree with it. Like, and if he thinks the chair stuff is stupid, then me and him also share the same opinion on the fucking chair. <laughs> this is so, crazy. So this guy, this motherfucker literally got mad for no reason. Like what this guy's saying, I agree with. Well, how did this happen? Okay. I agree with the part that I think it's fucked up that, that Lollafell players are getting messages. That, that is what I agree yeah. with. Okay. Someone who's very high up in the community, who has a lot of viewers, has a take like that. It's very frustrating because it just seems fucking irresponsible. 
Now, is it my job to determine what his responsibilities are? No. But at the end of the day, I'm entitled to that fucking opinion. And I think it was a huge Absolutely. L take. And many people in my chat also agreed. So this isn't some cognitive dissonance that exists just in my mind. Eh, I don't know, man. I don't think if you can use a... Eh, that's not a good metric, man, is your chat. I mean, no offense to you guys. I love you guys. I love you guys. But you see it in every fucking stream, man. It's an echo chamber. It's an echo chamber, man. Okay? Okay? But with that all being said, I don't want anyone coming over there saying shit either. This is crazy. Yeah, when I watched his, when I watched the clips the other night, man, there were some people that went over to the street. I think that's about it. God damn, bro, this was over a chair. They gotta put, some, they gotta bring out that deep dungeon soon. They gotta bring out this new raid like real quick. Like they gotta, bro, they gotta. It, it, it's out. Oh shit. And they're, st they're still in this? Oh my god, man. Like, this was crazy. Like, I spent an hour on this. What the fuck? Oh my god. Like, the, the chair exp I can't even believe I did this. But I just, I couldn't, I couldn't stop. For real, like, this shit was crazy. What the fuck? 